Hello everyone, Dragonfriend here, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Sky Factory. Um, last time we have been... What have we been working on actually? I think it was that thing right there. Yeah, definitely. Um, in the meantime, um, I have upgraded this guy. Um, it is now a tier 2, which is very nice. Um, that does... That did mean that I just had to make a whole lot more. Um, I now have this energizer, which um, I needed to make the empower. Well, why was that a thing? Well, the empower needed a double battery, and that one needed to be energized by the energizer. So, I needed this because in order to make the uh, growth crystal. I needed these greenhouse glass. Well, I needed empowered palace crystal block. How we made that is by using an empower. Well, empower, that's the middle one, and then the ones on the sides are these four display stands. So, we needed five more things in order to make this work. I put it up here right now because I don't know where to put it else. <laughs> Just as simple as that. I also, and you might have seen that on the way, have finished up this guy right here. So this one is making dust. And it's, yeah, so this one is primarily for the redstone um, that I'm going to use it. Um, because if we look at dust, 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 and then the sieve, that's bone meal, it's not bad, gunpowder, crushed black quartz, redstone, glowstone and blaze powder. So yeah, that, that's going very well, that's going very well. So the blaze powder is, is coming along nice. Um, so yeah, everything is filled up as it should be. So yeah, this guy is working perfectly as well right now. Um, they are even yeah, making more energy than what is needed, if I'm correct. And I hope that I am correct. I see that this one is, is at full capacity, but the rest is not. Don't exactly know why, but these guys are, are at full storage, almost. And I didn't notice that, um, and that was something that I noticed with this one. That these guys were at some point, or it was with this one. Yeah, these guys are at some point they were full. Don't know why, don't know how that happened. It doesn't really matter. So what I did was in order to keep everything here empty, they're just going right into the basic drawer. So that they just yeah. They vanish. Actually. So that is all set up as I wanted it. So yeah, this uh, it's a big glass, uh, yeah, factory here, with just this little bit of storage right there, and that's nice. I like that. So my plan of my course of action or plan of action, I don't know. Um, well, let's see what the achievement book says. Well, use nesting pens to automate resource collection from chickens. Well. That is something that we can do, actually. Um, also craft an iron seed and a diamond seed. Use a solium dagger to obtain a mob chunk. A master of use, premium apples, premium armor, and then we can fly. But I think that for now we are going to, to go for the nesting pens. What I also have been thinking about is making this area glass. Now glass is something that um, things cannot spawn on, so the, f the, the these two guys, this guy and this guy, will still be working the way they should. So that's nice. Now on the other hand, what I have been noticing is that I, I sometimes I'm a bit clumsy when walking, so I fell down. And yeah, that's just not what you want to do, you know? 
It's just not nice. It's just not nice at all. So uh, let's just get rid of all of these guys. That one's full, that one's up, that one's full, that one's full. That one I do not need. So. You know, this is just how I'm doing things right now. Uh, let's just open up these guys. Some wheat, some nether wart. Don't know why we need a loop slime crystal. Now, that does sound nice. So, mini coal right there. Barley is in there. Yeah, wheat is up there. Yeah. And then we've got these guys. Yep, cool. So, what I'm gonna do. Or at least what my plan is, is to start making um, something with the nesting pens. Nesting pen. So yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of egg nest. So that's where the, the wheat comes in. And now that I have a lot of wheat, that's nice. So what I'm gonna need, and let's see, nesting pens or chickens to collect resources and chickens will lay eggs. Use an animal nets to place chickens into the nesting pen. Placing two nesting pens will auto breed the ch two chickens. This works with modded chickens that allow special breeding. So that's pretty nice. There was something more. Uh, the special breeding mechanics. Nesting pens drop chicken manure, feathers and hatchery eggs. That's cool. And um, so that's gonna be up over on that side. But first I'm going to make the glass floor. And we are back the glass is in i have also and i've used this nice chisel so i've made this this glass nice it's just you can see that there is something there that that's what i wanted that it's not just clear and that's yeah they, they just scared to walk on it so yeah i like this what i've also done is i've made these um they, they were slabs but i thought that you know what, I want to change them up a bit, make them a bit, yeah, look look better. So I've made this into the braid. Um, and over here you've got the, these uh, connecting pieces, so it's the fancy one. Then you've got the vertical lines for just a walkway. You've got another fancy one, and then the blinds is... I've used it for this platform, but also over here for this one. For the, the surrounding uh, for the border um, I haven't done this one that's because this entire platform will at some point be gone because at some point I'm not gonna put the trees up there um, so maybe I'm thinking why don't I just create the the nesting pens over here because we've got that little bit of factory over there no um, you know what let's don't let's not do that this will be a storage system in the end um, so yeah, nesting pens will be here. I will make it of the same type. So again, the blinds. That will be the... Uh, so th this is just for the walkways. And this is just the, the connecting pieces. And these are for the platforms that have things on it. So... Um, now I, ha I have been thinking, and I do like the nesting pens, but I'm not quite sure how to do that. So I have to, to get into that and see how I'm supposed to, to use those. Because there is a lot to it and I don't have a lot of time at this point. Um, so what I'm going to do is I want to start on that Supremium Armor. So if we look at Supremium Armor, because Supremium Armor gives me flight. And then you also can put some charm slot, but let's just first focus on this. So it's premium helmet, chest plate, leggings, boots. That's what I need. But in order to do that, I need some premium essence. So how do I get that? I need superior essence. I need intermediate essence. I need prudentium essence. Inferior essence. That is something that I have. Well, I'd like to make an infusion crystal in order to do that. Uh, the, the master infusion crystal. So if I can make a normal infusion crystal I can use on all of them. So that's nice to start with. But in order to make this, this one, 
the, the master one, the, the, the unlimited one, I'm gonna need a nether star. And in order to make a nether star, I'm gonna be needing wither skeleton skulls. Now, if you're wondering how I'm supposed to do that, well, fun fact if you um, combine skeletons with witch water, they will actually turn into um, wither skeletons. So, what I'm thinking is, you've of course got this, this giant thing over here. Yeah, Ooh, yeah, okay. And what I'm thinking is what if we were to place another part up there and use that part for making wither skeletons or, or wither things combining the witch water with it um, I think that that could work pretty well so um, of course we have witch water here I'm just uh, thinking how I am supposed to do that come on and at this point I'm not quite sure how I can make that work. Um, so I'm gonna do some some small research for it. Um, yeah, these are still oh my god, so much stuff. You got banner. What what do I want with a banner? Come on, guys. I need to automate that thing down there as well. <laughs> Which I don't want to. Um, so yeah, in order to maximize the getting the, 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 the words, wow, I'm doing great. <laughs> in order to maximize the chance of getting the, um, the the heads, I can use and let me just get this book. I can use this beheading thing right here, and I can put that on my sword in order to make it yeah work with beheading um working an ender pearl and some obsidian on a weapon has the curious effect of separating the target's head from its body just a little off the top so yeah they drop their heads adding more obsidian and ender pearls increase the chance of decapitation to multiple levels yeah okay so i'm definitely going to do that but i'm thinking what if we would just keep this, and I'm, I'm probably going to make a uh, walkway around it. And then we put some sort of button somewhere, or, or a lever, and just at the end have a dispenser. A dispenser with a bucket in it, and that will drop out which one. That way we can just keep using the normal spawner and the rates will not be affected at all but still have the witch water effect when we want it I think that that could work possibly hopefully so, <laughs> so let me let me let me take a look at that and uh, because that may be the easy solution for for my problem right now so I think I'm gonna do that and then I'll be back with you when I'm hopefully having some wither skeletons Alright guys, it is working. There you can see the witch water and there is one skeleton which should be, and I'm hoping that it is, a widow skeleton. So I am gonna get my beheading on my uh, sword. Let's just get some ender pearls and let me get some metal. Thank you. Some, um, yeah. Because it was stackable, that's what it said, right? So, let's see how this works. We are going to put the heading on it. 
That's beheading. That's beheading two. That's beheading three. Can I make it more? That's the big question right now, right? Like, how far can you go with beheading? Beheading four. Can I go to five? Not from that one. Okay, but from this one. <laughs> no, I've got enough of them lying around, so it's really no big deal. So, would beheading five be the max? That would make sense. Uh, wait, let me let me see. Tinkers construct beheading. All of ours be uh, yeah. Come on, beheading. All the way to X, so I can put in total 10 of those. So, if I want, I can put 5 more. Let's do it. I want more heads. 1, 2, 3. More heads is better. <laughs> I hope. Should be, right? So there we go, that's that, and that's... No, 5 is the max. Or is that just because I do not have any modifiers left? It could be. I mean... Don't have a lot, probably. Could be that that's the case, but... Yeah, you know... I'm not complaining at all, man. You know, beheading is beheading. I love the look of it. That's good. That is good, that is nice. So... Let's just flick it on again. There it is. Oh my god, those are supercharged creepers. Let's flick it off again, so that they will settle down and get damaged. Oh my god, no 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 no. Why is this a thing? Damn. Spiders. Alright, so. Hello, little man. She stop killing. All of them. But those are all those skeletons I was talking about. Let's just hope. Yes! We have got weird little skeleton skulls. Nice. We've got what we wanted. It's working. I like that. I like that a lot. So. Let's just take all of this out. Put it all into this guy. I don't like the spiders. That's, that's... No, don't like that. Do not like. Yeah, okay. But yeah, the widow skeletons. There we go. That's something. That's something in it. That's cool. That's really nice. Okay. And I get widow dust. I can do stuff with that, I don't know what. With a widow trap with that. What is a widow trap? Dark sugar, soul sand. Wither dust block, nice. Widow trap, dwindle cream, unstable end of pearl. I don't know if you would want that. With a widow trap, these traps will apply an effect to a mob when they stand on it. For example, the sonus trap will give a sonus effect. Okay. So the Wither Trap actually gives it the Wither effect. That is actually pretty interesting. I'm not gonna use them. That's for, for sure, actually. But yeah, I, I just needed three skulls. And I got that in the first go. So yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty interesting, that's for sure. So yeah. I think uh, next up on the agenda is uh, killing the wither, but that will probably be in the next episode. Yeah, it will be. Because I don't believe, no I don't have the time, I'm even over 
I think I'm a little bit over my, my 20 minute mark. But anyway, I do hope you enjoyed. We did some some nice things. We uh, fixed up the base a bit and um, yeah, made sure that we can we can make withers and kill them. That was fast. Jeez. I really thought that it would take a while before it would work. I just don't uh, the, the spiders that they they are Damn annoying, man. They are damn annoying. But how I did this, and uh, so I've got this lever here with the uh, redstone conduit going all the way to the back, and then up there is the dispenser. And why is it up there? Because if I would put it over here, it would be, yeah, affected by this lever, and I do not want it. So this redstone conduit is just going up and over, and yeah, it just works perfectly, man just works perfectly and I love it I just love it so yeah we have done some nice things today so I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in the next episode bye bye